Welcome back to the channel, man. Crypto Tro. I am Crypto Tro, bringing you the latest and the greatest in cryptocurrency. And today, I'm going to give you an update on the Mad Meerkat tree houses. Yes, the sale just happened this past weekend and it sold out within one minute, man. So this drop, this mint went absolutely crazy. And as you can see, they're showing the tree houses right now in this video. And it's just your own personal gallery of NFTs, your social media presentation or representation, your ability to stay for mad and much, much more, man. So this is an exciting video. I happen to be able to buy one treehouse. I didn't get a chance to mint, but we're going to talk about that in the video. But we're going to get straight into it. But before we do, make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel. I update on the Mad Meerkat and MML Finance very, very often, man. So that's one of my favorite projects right now. So if you're interested in a Mad Meerkat treehouses, in a Mad Meerkats, or just MM Finance, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe, and I'm going to continuously update you. And also make sure you follow me on Twitter, troll underscore crypto. And we're going to get into it just like that, man. So today I really just wanted to just go over some of the things in the Medium article that it, the Mad Meerkat family just dropped. And also we're going to just look at the floor price of the Mad Meerkat tree houses and just examine that a little bit, man. So let's get straight into it. So celebrating the overwhelming madness of MMT. So this article is on Medium. You can go to the Mad Meerkat treehouse or the Mad Meerkat NFT Twitter page to read this entire article. Really, I just want to go over some of the stats, man, that happened doing this, man, because Chronos blockchain, it did shut down and I was very much pissed. I ain't gonna lie to y'all. I was there when the sale went off. I swear I hit mint as soon as it hit the time, but I was not able to mint one and I was kind of mad at the moment. Just me being kind of a little selfish because I did want to mint, but all in all, is I'm very bullish on it just because of how fast it sold out, man. So you can take the good with the good and the bad with the bad. It is what it is, but I always want to take and just view it from a positive note and really just see like how bullish this is for the project, no matter if you were able to mint one or if you had to buy off a secondary market. So scrolling down, you know, mass sequence that is the developer, the top head huncho of the project, man. But I'm not going to read, like I said, all of this. Oh, you can go and read it for yourself. He was just really expressing how happy he was and how grateful he was for, you know, how fast the project sold out. But really, I just want to look at this mint performance, man. So we see the ETH mint with the supply of 550 sold out in one minute, man. Then we see the Crow whitelist mint supply of 2750 sold out in 12 minutes. Then the public mint of 4,500 sold out in 15 minutes. And I believe it probably would have been faster if the Kronos blockchain was able to handle all of those transactions because the Kronos blockchain absolutely crashed when it was time to mint. But that's understandable just being a new blockchain and with that many people being on it that time it wasn't or it hasn't seen anything like this so you got to understand that was probably one of the or if not the biggest day for the chronos blockchain since being established man so we see the total time eclipse was 28 minutes under half an hour while the entire chronos chain was in shambles so it took less than an hour while the chain was still going slow man so that's still a good thing just because if the chain was up to speed it probably would have went faster i swear i'm telling you it was going that fast man then we see the secondary market performance so we see it was listed on eb Sue's bay and then one hour since the listening achieved one million in secondary volume on eb Sue's bay so one million in secondary volume man then six hours in the listening we saw it achieve 2.4 million in crow in secondary volume on EB Sue's Bay. And now MMT is the number two most traded NFT on EB Sue's Bay right after the Mad 
meerkat man so this is very very bullish this drop absolutely crushed the chronos blockchain and then just the secondary volume on ebsu's bay you can see that this is a hot nlt project man and just like mad meerkat i just so happened to get in mad meerkat right before it went on the explosion to the 3790 floor price uh, i think i got in like right at like 900 crow man so if you were able to get a mad meerkat or a mad meerkat treehouse that is big just because of the utility that is going to have man if you know if you read the white paper and you know about the treehouse you know it's so much utility we have the mad sex coming uh the mad token is coming first then the mad sex and it's going to be just crazy man so let's continue to scroll down we see on march 7th eb Sus bay is top four in daily volume for marketplace thanks to mmt so we see now here this is just a screenshot from dow radar and it just covers all of the nft projects and once we click on it we see or we really can't click on it because it's, it's a screenshot but we can see it's kind of blurry a little bit number one is oversee two is looks rare three gem and then fourth place is eb Sus bay and we see on the day it was 1.6 million dollars transactions on that day man so that's crazy going crazy just because it's still such a small marketplace but it continues to grow as the chronos blockchain grows and we can see above eb Sus bay is projects that are on the east blockchain man so really ETH been around so we know people are familiar with you know buying nfts on the ETH blockchain but chronos is coming in with EB Sus Bay in fourth place right now. So that's something major and something, you know, very, very bullish in my personal opinion. Then we see within two days, 4 million crow in secondary volume, man. That's a new record for daily volume on EB Sus Bay and, you know, a record for the Mad Meerkat Treehouse, man. So two words to describe these resorts or these results. Hey, I just got tongue twist right there overwhelmingly mad man so it's going crazy we are going going crazy but let's get into the action items this is what we've been waiting for we see already one through three has been completed you know of course execute the contingency plan for failments then setting up a page to tabulate eth og77 that failed to mint in all rounds and give those refunds and then three we see the MMT airdrop that's completed. That was done on the third. So now we see we're waiting on the lottery winners. That's currently in progress. That will be done supposedly by tomorrow. But you know, you got to give it give a little leeway. But we see next is the airdropping the lottery winners. And that's going to be done on the 10th. Then we see coming in next, staking the utility of MMT O M M O. So if you wanted to use your treehouse on MMO, you can earn an extra percentage just by doing that. And that should be available in three days. Then we see the MMT platform launch and that's estimated on the 21st, man. So that MMT platform launch is going to be big because that is where you will be able to actually stake your and place your NFTs that have partnered with the MAD meerkat and also you can stake your mad meerkats then we see the mad lunge and it's estimated on the 23rd man so it's a lot of things that's in the works this month and it's going to be a very very bullish month we know right now in the crypto space we are in i guess you can say some type of bear market if you want to say that but prices are down but mad meerkat continues to break records and we see the price in terms of crow continues to go up, man. So that's very bullish, especially with these NFTs that have utility. And I know people like to say utility is like one of those hot words or a uh, hot topic words or whatnot. But these NFTs actually have utility where you can actually stake your NFTs and earn a better percentage, man. And you really cannot beat that in my personal opinion. So now let's check out the floor price of the Mad Meerkat Treehouse, man. So we want to go to madmeerkat.io and then pretty much just click on at the top, buy MMT. So we see right now the floor price is at $29.70 and currently at the price of Crow, that's about 
dollars, man. So not too bad. I think the the mint price was uh around what uh three hundred. So you know if you were able to mint, you could have made a good little come up, especially you know if you got in there early. So shout out to everybody. But I gotta say too, it's still not too late. Just think about it. Once you buy the treehouse, you'll be able to stake and produce at least one mad per day. And then if you have other crow NFTs or mad meerkats, you can earn an extra percentage. And I believe the mad meerkats are 10% each. So 10% per mad meerkat. And I believe, I know the crow NFT project says something about 3.5% per NFTs. Um, but you will have to go back and do your own research and check that out for yourself, man. But I know you can earn an extra percentage just by participating in the uh, Mad Meerkat Treehouse staking with the projects that are whitelisted. So you can check that out. Check and see if you have any crow NFTs on there where you can earn an extra percentage. And then just look at all of these different treehouses, man. You can get, like I said, the floor price is about a thousand dollars right now, but I'm telling you, it, it's gonna be worth it, in my opinion. And I know this is an end, and I know this is the end of the video, but I gotta say this: this is not financial advice. This is just my personal take on things, and me just analyzing everything that's in the market right now. Like I said, I'm just pretty much showing my journey of investing, man. So. You can take it how you want to, but always do your own research and consult with a financial advisor before you do anything investing. So <laughs> I had to get that little spill a little bit. You know how that go. But we see all of these different tree houses, man. Just a lot of different tree houses. I might scoop one more up. I don't know, though. I don't know. I might. It just depends what the floor price is going to continue to go up. So I need to make a decision. ASAP. But that's my video for today, man. Just wanted to show you the amazing drop mint session that the Mad Meerkat Treehouse has done. And just the community overall just continue to push this project and push up their floor price and just giving it so much utility, man. All of the different utilities you can use with this and just the entire team. Like I said, the entire team is just... I don't know. This is one of the best teams in the crypto space, in my personal opinion. So that's my video for today. Crypto Tro. Like I said, make sure you subscribe to the YouTube channel. If I added value to you today, I'm out of here.